everybody good morning and welcome to your monday morning fields how have you guys been i have been great since i've been back um yeah just great i'm here to do your monday morning fields guys we're going to take what resonates leave what doesn't let's uh go through our bullshit let's own it that way we go through it we forgive ourselves most importantly and we forgive the situation and the person um it's not your story Maybe next week or go to my Instagram where I do weekend fills. Go to my TikTok where I go live or I just do a two card, pick a, a two card draw every day. Um, I do have your cross watcher heavens up. I started a new series. It started airing last night. Um, it is if you're with your own sign. So a good thing to do also is to know what the, your moon, sun, and rising is and what theirs is. So it's like Aquarius versus Aquarius, them versus your feelings, you know. But friendship, whatever, you're going to take whatever resonates. But, you know, if it's not resonating there, you got to realize they have a moon, they have a sun, and they have a rising, and they have a Venus. And those are very heavy placements, like mine. I only have Lee in those Virgo, Sun, and the rest is Libra. So, anyways, guys, those are going up. I'm having a great time. I am going to start a, a special series here for subscribers only. So, if you've not subscribed, please do so. I'll be giving giveaways in those uh, readings, not only just readings. I have deck of cards I'm going to be giving out. Um, I have certificates from other tarot readers that I'll be giving out. So, uh, please like and subscribe. That's going to start not after this weekend, after the next weekend. So, not this Monday morning, feels the next. I will come on for subscribers only. I will give offers of contest and then, and then I will do a reading. My readings will be with my healing stones, which I will not be doing unless it's for subscribers only because it takes a lot of my energy and a lot more time than normal reads guys but i want to really do this for you guys and and for um showing you know thankfulness and appreciation for the support of actually subscribing you know a lot of people and i was one of those people just guilty as hell just watching readings watching readings learning so much learn and learn but I wouldn't give the subscribe. I wouldn't give the like just because of whatever. So, you know, I'm not only trying to, um, in, uh, not influence, but it is influence, but encourage you. But I'm also wanting to give back and thank you for going ahead and doing so. That support means so much to me. So let's stop the BS. You got to get to work. So let's see what's going on. This could be friends, family, um, relationship, you name it. It's, if it resonates, it's yours. If not, let's catch you another time. Guys, I'm very excited to start doing subs, subs only uh, ratings. I will, of course, continue on my journey with everything else, but those are going to be a little bit deeper and a little bit more. I also, um, I've opened up a lot and been myself a lot over here, but, you know, I'm going to start being a little bit more. So if I... friends martini time see if i bring out some personality now go to with your friends and talk shit or are you going with your friends and gonna just have them help you discover what's going on with your problem probably going to talk shit then discovering your problem because that's what happens look like i got guided by you spirit let's go for the weekday feels for youtube here on youtube <laughs> I woke up funky, it's cloudy, then it's sunny, so I'm just doing this. It's boring in Vegas. I'm going to do some candles and necklaces. I got to get out this week. I don't know how to ship them. I guess I'm going to get dry ice. I've never had this big of an order where I couldn't say not at this time. So I'm going to get them out. I'll dry ice them. So guys, go over to my um, Instagram. You can see some of my work at the very bottom. I need to start advertising it more. It's not something I've been doing, but... I've been getting a lot more orders, so I'm crafting a lot more. Now that it's summer, it's best to make anyways. What's up Monday? What's up Monday? Letter, you're going to get a message. Somebody's going to be reaching out. Who's reaching out? We'll find out through tarot. Uh, no, we don't have to wait for tarot. Soulmate. Soulmate, guys, can be a friend. It can be a family. It can be wh whoever. A connection from your past 
has emerged. Embrace the connection. Oh, well, I think it's romance here. Maybe you get a message from a friend from Martini time about their soulmate and they're falling in love. I don't know. We're going to find out. Okay, so let's go. Thursday, Thursday. What is going on with this soulmate and row? You're good. Somebody. Okay. Ah! So somebody's going to be sending a message, you or them, how, you know, you're finding them attractive. You're feeling a very deep connection with them. You know, you have these feelings. You want to explore them. And somehow, it turns into sexual union already. Somehow. Happens. Can't say it doesn't. None of us is the Virgin Mary. And if anybody's going to be, it's going to be a Virgo, which is me, not... Mm -mm. Healing. So by Friday, like... A time for reflection prayers will help you with a situation. Let's go. Let by God, guided by you, Spirit. Let's do this. All my cards feel fantastic from that Capricorn full moon. Mm. Yes, they do. This whole thing does. Let by God, guided by you, Spirit. Let's do this. Last one out. Last one out. I miss my my hiking days. I did go get my nails done finally today. It took forever. This happened a, while, a long time ago with a friend where uh, it was a diet, a keto's, I believe it was. And now lately I've been eating a lot of spinach and salads and stuff. It was embarrassing because her hands started turning, her gloves started turning. But I remember that happened before. So I didn't get to, I just told her, I eat too many vegetables right now. Let's go. What's this letter or message on Monday? Let's go. What is the message? If we could find out who it's from, would be great too. I just saw the moon. It slipped over in there. Oh, nine of swords. Guys, some ugly stuff coming out here. Already flipped. Nine of moon, nine of swords. Well, it was there. Oh, there it is. Okay. Can we get two more out, please? Two more out for Monday. Thank you. Oh, my God. Guys, I think you're sending a letter to somebody else and not this person that's coming. I think it's somebody's ass that was too toxic for you, too burdensome, and you're finding justice. I want to see the Eight of Cups. Healing. Patience. I did see the Six of Swords. I do believe this is somebody else that you're sending a message that you are done. Devil, ten of wands, burden his ass with their toxic ways, insecurities, manipulation, addictions. It could be anything that you feel is damn toxic. And I always say this, if you stayed in a toxic relationship, you're just as damn toxic. You got to go when you realize it's toxic. And you're realizing that with your justice. Damn. That's ugly to open up with devil next to the Ten of Wands. But beautiful to see justice is there. We always love a Libra showing up like that. Balancing out the scales and yourself. You're feeling just, yep. No, you're, gonna, you're sending a message of you're too much, you're too toxic. I have recently connected with somebody else. That's what I'm feeling. And this could be a friendship. But you are moving on, okay? Yeah, Queen of Swords coming out to the side. So she, you're, you're going to set boundaries with this person. You're going to set, 
the intentions, I don't know, it came out kind of to the side, but I've been letting spirit or my intuition tell me up or down for, uh, but it is always still a kind of, like you're sort of, but you set, boundaries have not been set with this soulmate yet because why you're completing that one cycle, starting a new new one, healing, and there's your king of swords, there's your counterpart waiting. As soon as you complete that out and you do your healing, queen of swords, king of swords. I mean, what the hell else? Oh, gonna rush in together. Yes, I'm loving it. A lot of swords here, guys. Lots of air. Lots of air on the table. We, I know we already got Libra going on. We have Capricorn over there, too, with their devil ass. Queen of Wands. So you're, um, you know what? You're feeling more gentle with this person. You're feeling more, uh, uh, where you don't need to be the Queen of Swords. Um, you will come in as a Queen of Wands and be more compassionate and dispassion, period. And creative and beautiful and very secure with yourself and not manipulative and you're going to um not need to be the queen of swords she'll set the boundaries for you in a nicer way don't be fooled though because there's still a tower to come before your ten of cups with this person but oh my god forget about ten of cups and ten of pentacles yes i love it so these two together, you're going to be shook and that love is not the way you were seeing it before with this other person. It is Ten of Cups, Ten of Pentacles. That tower will hit. Like I said, don't be fooled. And before I said that, I saw the moon and I just saw the moon and I didn't see all that other. And that's what it is. You've been fooled. You think love was supposed to feel and be that way. Well, this Queen of Wands is showing up to tell you it's this way. And you're going to love it. I already see. Ten of Cups, Ten of Pentacles. Is there one more out for this one? Knight of Wands, yep. Coming in, playful, happy, joyful. He doesn't always have to be a player. Sometimes he's known a lot to be in and out of life. We're not air conditioning the whole damn, outs, uh, you know, so this is not an in and out situation. I'm feeling that, you know, they're coming in to be playful. You're the one coming in now to be able to be playful with this queen of wands. All right. You're not going to be crying over that five of cups for long. You know, you need, that's cute. I like it. So it's to the side, guys. Romance. You may feel this person might be a little sneaky or you're just carrying this still, because this is awfully quick to jump from this to this and what we saw at the Ten of Cups. So it's, it's a pretty quick move on. Okay, make sure you're healed, guys. If you're still thinking about another person, you're not ready to go into a relationship, all right? Just saying. And I'm not saying think about them. I mean, we stumble across people that we were with 20 years ago in our mind, but I'm not saying that. Working hard. Good for you. Oh my God, start stabilizing yourself to make yourself happy to come together. God, this is great, guys. I like this Monday morning fields. Let's go. Let's go. I feel this per death is in the reverse because this person, you may have work to do still because I feel... Yeah, right when the devil, the star comes out reverse. So guys, you need to do this work, all right? Before you, you, you go to get that king of swords to come along with you to, for that ten and a cups and pentacles. You're coming from out some, from some drama. That's why patience is here again. You need to be patient. This person's here. But by the end of this week, you're dis they're discovering, you're discovering... The passion in this, they're discovering, and we're going to get to passion with some sexual union. And then I think that both of you realize one or both of you still need some healing from this crap, the shit that somebody chose to put on you. Okay, let's go. Sexual union. Wow. Okay. Yeah, clear clarity. You want sexual union. You're clear on this. All right. I love the answers. Yes. 
Thank you, universe and spirit. My spirit's in the universe, and I've been doing real good. Yep, after coming out of Hermit, you guys might go in, and, you know, you guys might do some deep introflection <clears throat> about this sexual union, this romance. Because, like I said, I do feel that there is still healing needed on both sides, to be honest, not just yours. Yeah, interflection about regrets from the past. But you're clear you want this sexual union. You're clear on it. There's just a lot of healing that needs to be done. Now, this could be somebody that you were friends with, and now all of a sudden, things have changed, okay? And uh, they've seen you go through a bad relationship. You've seen them go through bad relationships. There's always been a thing, but you've never had this time. So you may heal each other here with the hermit going within, reflecting from regrets, getting that clarity. This is meant, but you're going to have to heal. Heal is all over this place. There's a lot of passion, but there's a lot of damn healing here too. Okay. Chariot moving forward. Uh, five of Pentacles and Ace of Pentacles. So, yes, you want to move forward. Come you know, coming out. Like, this guy's reaching out in this Five of Pentacles. This is an abandoned card, but they're coming, they're reaching out to you to come out of that and for what? To offer a new beginning, a new start, stability, um, love, something golden and pretty, just like that Ace of Coins. Hey, guys, I love it. Yes, strength is needed. We get it to make this decision for the two of you to work together. Three of coins. This is in your two luck and fate. Oh my God, just stop. And there you go with your nine of pentacles. Look at sexy coming out of for three of four. Okay, so yes, it's going to take strength for both of you to heal this and yourselves. You're, it's going to to make this decision to be together, to work together, to help heal each other. Be, you both are in the will of fortune here in the luck because this is a divinely guided union you marry each other this is beautiful all right guys let's go ahead and get you a couple of your little cards that i like to do on monday morning feels only somebody sent me one of my clients sent me this deck i don't know i don't know how to make sense of them I'm going to go through a deck, my decks with you guys one day, but they're pretty cool. I wonder why I'm pulling these, right? You know, I've had them for a few weeks there. Shall we get into them then? I guess. I don't want to. I want to go to what I wanted to do. I need to connect with these. I've tried... There's a lot of cards, guys. I have so many decks that I'm still connecting to, and I never, do, I don't, and then all of a sudden I'll be like drawn to it, and I'll just play with it for a little bit, and then it ends up coming back out into rotation or into my um, decks that are for my private readings. My stones have become very popular. I've been doing those a lot more, though. That's why I'm going to do them for subs only. I need to get some of my readers to come and talk underneath here to my clients so that they could tell you just how great these stone readings are coming out. Like I get chills, they get, it's crying, it's a lot. And it's just words that I'm working and my full intuition and spirit completely there when I get to those stones. One step at a time, perfect guys, yes. Healing, again, healing. Lots of healing needed, gratitude, decide passion everything i've talked about here is guidance you know ask for that guidance peace and you're on the right track guys i love all those right now for this read because they just came out perfect like i said me and spirit we are just on fire lately anyways guys check out your sign versus the same sign uh readings check out your cross watcher heavens Go over to my TikTok. I will be starting those new sub-only readings, um, subscribers. Um, anyways, be blessed, be well, and bye for now, guys. Have a great week.